Okay, so when it comes to staging the wheat, you want to pull out an individual plant, and this particular plant has one main stem, and it's got one, two, and a third tiller starting to come here right there. Um, stage your main stem, so don't try to stage the tillers. So I'm just going to break these off here uh, to get down to here. Now, what you're looking for, what you're trying to feel for is these bumps or a node in, in the stem. So just run your, your thumb and your forefinger up the stem and you can feel a bump. And when I do that, I can feel one right here and then I feel a second one up here, but I don't feel a third one yet. So I have two nodes, which means if I had just one, it would be feet six. Two nodes means we're at feet seven. Uh, and the, the, where the head is, developing head is at in the stem is up here at the top of the uppermost node. So we're going to want to dissect this to identify and find where that is at, where the developing head is. Um, and we're just going to kind of finish our staging discussion here. So we're going to strip these leaves back. What I'm looking for is the leaf that is attached to this bottom node because that will be considered leaf number one. Um, and then there will be four leaves above it. The fourth leaf above it will be the flag leaf, which is the penultimate leaf, which is the last leaf out uh, before the head emerges. Uh, so if I strip this back, this uh, leaf right here is attached to this node. So this is leaf one, this is leaf number two, this is leaf number three, and then right there is your flag leaf just starting to emerge out of the whirl right here. So when we're staging this trying to identify um, damage uh, for frost, we, we want to uh, slice this open so that we can expose the head. So I'm going to slice this open on my leg here and then I'll explain what we're seeing inside the, the plant or inside the stem. Okay, so um, I'll hold this stem open here and down here at the bottom is our first node right here and then there's what this is what's called the space in between these two nodes right here is called our inner node space so this is node number two this is what determines that this one is at peak eight or sorry peak seven um, and then the developing head is actually pushed up right here and you can see the little teeny tiny spikelets on that head 